Oh, hello, everybody. My name is Ben. And this is going to be some Battlefield 1. Battlefield 1 beta on Conquest. Uh, I cannot, uh, for the life of me, remember what this map is called. I'm sure after the hundreds of hours I will play once the game is released, I will know these maps uh, by name, by heart. I'll see them in my nightmares and in my dreams. But until that point happens, I cannot, for the life of me, remember what this damn map is called. But I do hope you guys enjoy this, this Battlefield 1 gameplay uh, and enjoy my commentary and right now I'm on a horse do I need to say more actually I probably should because I have another seven minutes to go <laughs> uh, if this does get put up on Thunderstruck Gaming I would like to uh, say a big a big thank you to Thunder and the Thunderstruck Gaming community the last video I put up or I had put up on Thunderstruck Gaming was a Battlefield 3 video, uh, Strike at Carcand Conquest. Uh, that would have been like four, maybe even five years ago. I would say probably about four years ago. And I made, as a result of the video, obviously I got some people to my channel. I don't really do these community channels to get traffic to my channel. I'm more the kind of person that makes YouTube content to uh, promote the game because I freaking love Battlefield. And uh, as a result of, of the other video that got up on Thunderstruck Gaming those many, many years ago. I had some pretty good friends. I, I met some pretty cool uh, squad mates, played a lot of rounds with some pretty pretty chill people. And that's one of the things that I like about YouTube is, is you don't necessarily need to have a huge fan base to meet really cool people. Um, other content creators here on TSG and also the people that watch the videos just in the comment section, you know, the, the level of chill is pretty, is pretty high and I like that. So if anybody wants to play some Battlefield 1 with me, uh, my gamer tag is Benjisor. It's the same on the Xbox. It's the same on uh, Origin. This is from the uh, Xbox One version because the PC beta for Battlefield 1 for me did not run very well. I might have to put an asterisk on that because it ran well. Like I was getting about six or 60 or 70 FPS, which for my... Uh, gaming computer is pretty good. It's about a five-year-old gaming rig, so it, it's a little dated in terms of uh, the newer tech. The problem with, with the PC version of the beta for me was the fact that while it was running at about 60 to 70 FPS, every few minutes it would drop down to about 15 to 20. And then it would spike back up to 60 to 70, and then when it dropped down the second time, Battlefield1.exe would go unresponsive and it would crash out on me. And that's just, uh, I think it was Battlefield 3 and 4 were the same way for me. It just takes a while to get that the, the drivers updated for the graphics cards, especially on my computer because it's, it's older now. So they're not, they may not necessarily, uh, NVIDIA may not be pushing the support for the, uh, the GTX 590 that I have in my computer. And that's cool. I mean, that'll happen over time. It'll, it'll get better and smooth out. In the meantime, I'll have, probably will be playing this on the Xbox. And I want to talk briefly about the, the rest of this fall lineup. I mean, this is the, the season for games. There is so many pretty impressive looking titles coming out this fall. Uh, I'm doing this video on October 10th, and I believe the Battlefield 1 uh, EA Origin or EA Early Access or whatever that, that, that monthly subscription service for EA Games is the early access. I think that starts on the 12th for Battlefield 1. So this is pretty damn close to when the actual game is coming out. And then uh, you have Titanfall 2 dropping on the 28th, which is also my birthday, which is pretty cool too, because now I can get to, get to take my birthday off work and uh, play Titanfall all day. Um, and obviously in, the, in, the, in November, you have Infinite Warfare and COD 4 Remastered coming out. And for me... The major titles this fall will be Battlefield 1 and Titanfall 2. They pretty much hit all my major FPS desires. I love the World War setting. Uh, the, I love the semi-automatics, the bolt actions. Generally, they have a slower time to kill. They allow a little bit more, a little bit more for skill. You know, you have to actually be able to control your weapon. It's not just hold the button down until you see points. Which is one of the complaints that I had with Battlefield 3 and 4. Is a lot of the weapons felt way too easy to use. Uh, Battlefield 1 is not like that. There are no lock-on weapons for the vehicles, so you can get into a tank and 
have some fun. And this is I'm in a light tank right now, and this is one of these vehicles that has they dice the developer has come out and said they will be changing this light tank so it's not going to be nearly as as effective as it was in the beta. It's unfortunate, but I'm a I'm a believer that video game vehicles and video games should be a little scarier. Like when you see a tank in Battlefield, it should be kind of a terrifying thing. You don't necessarily want a a, a, a super easy to kill vehicle, at least in my eyes. I know you guys that are watching this may be more of a fan of the infantry side of the combat, but I'm more of a a vehicle side in a game like Battlefield. I prefer getting in the tanks or, or the helicopters. There's no helicopters in Battlefield 1. Obviously, it's World War 1. Helicopters didn't really come onto the scene until the 1950s. So maybe if there's ever a Korean War be Battlefield game, we can get some helicopters. But uh, Battlefield 1, there will be no helicopters. So I wanted to kind of take a little break. Th those are the, uh, the games that I'm hyped for for the fall. They cover pretty much the gambit of shooters. You got the old school, and you got the futuristic stuff. I wanted to let, ask you guys a question. Uh, what are you most hyped up for this fall? Are you going to be a, a future player? Are you going to be playing the space game in Infinite Warfare? Flying around in space, trying to pretend to be a, uh, a less cool Master Chief? Or are you going to be doing the... The, the poor drafted uh, infantry grunt combat of World War One with me in Battlefield 1. We're going to be doing the Titan fall, dropping, you know, Titan mech piloting, all that cool badass stuff in Titanfall 2. Or are you going to be playing the classic COD 4 Remastered? Or all the above? <laughs> uh, the, every fall, the, we all run into this problem every fall, that there is a sh shitload of great games come, that are out in the fall, pardon my language. It's one of the things that I don't really like about the fall gaming schedule because there's so many games and they're all fun. This is just four of them. I'm sure there are a buttload more that are coming out that will be equally as, as enjoyable. But the video's round down here. Hopefully you all enjoyed this. This is, like I said, beta footage uh, from Conquest. So it may change depending on when you're watching this and versus when the game comes out. If you like Battlefield and you like Titanfall, please uh, swing by my channel. I've got a, a bunch of stuff from both those games, or both those franchises, and uh, videos coming from me. A little bit mixture of uh, of some real life gym footage, Battlefield One, Titanfall Two, and as this wraps down, I just want to take a, a minute or two to thank uh, the folks at Thunderstruck Gaming for giving me this opportunity, and hopefully you all enjoyed this. I am Ben, this has been Battlefield 1, and until next time, happy fragging.